Here are the starters for the eighth race. Number one, BP Silent Weapon, owned by Buddy and Anthony Simpson of Fairfield, trained by Clay Simpson. Buddy Simpson is up. 1A is DP's May, owned by Buddy Simpson of Fairfield, Phil Pierce and Dixie Ackerman of Carmi, trained and driven by Clay Simpson. Number two, Patetico, owned by Ronald Lott of Athens by Graham Ross Jr. of Covington, Tennessee, trained by Ross, the driver Tom Simmons. Number three, Zibber Bibber B. Owned by John Krastick and Jr. of Streeter, trained by Irvin Miller, the driver is Tony Morgan. Number four, Major Countess, owned by John Finn of Newton, trained by John Finn, the driver is Fred Finn Jr. Number five is Illini Jude, owned by Brian Lohman of Broadlands and Jackie Dodd of Seidel, trained by Rick Schrock. Rick Schrock is driving. Number six, Apple Dumpling, is owned by Melissa and Frank Fisher of Albion, trained by Frank Fisher. The driver is Pat Malloy, Jr. Number seven, Specially Fine, is owned by Orville Rush of Taylor Ridge, trained by Dave Van Der Rostein with Randall Finn in the bike. Number eight, Katie Bell, owned by Donald Coleman of Lebanon, Illinois, by Jim Geis of Chicago, trained by Irvin Miller. Andy Miller is up. And number nine, OG's Susie P, owned by Bobby Dexter of Paducah, Kentucky, and by Ernest Smith of Clinton, Mississippi, trained by Ernie Smith. The driver is Mike Rogers. Post time in four minutes. Buddy Simpson, also with 10 wins in the County Fair Challenge as a trainer. Right now, they're at the post. The gate's rolling for the challenge race for two-year-old pacing Phillies. And here they come. They're off and pacing. OG Susie P grabs the racetrack. Katie Bell is right there as well. Problems for Illini Jude, who is off stride at the start. Into the first turn, Patetico with a ground-saving trip, moves up to challenge Major Countess in between horses. Now gets the lead, especially fine. Is charging forward past those two on the outside. In the first turn, OG Susie P has just made a break. There goes especially fine up alongside of Major Countess, who has the lead three parts of a length. And especially fine is parked out. Now finds a spot toward the rail in second, 20 seven and four for the opening quarter. Patetico is third. Katie Bell is fourth. Apple Dumpling is parked and moving up fifth. Four lengths off the lead. Zibber Bibber B moves with cover behind her. And then further back it is BP Silent Weapon. DP's May moves by her on the outside. Six legs from the front and a gap of ten more to Illini Jude. Another five to OG Susie P who is last after a break. Major Countess is on top by one length. Specially fine is second ahead. Apple Dumpling is parked third. Zibber Bibber B goes fourth on the outside with cover, followed by Patetico, who's buried toward the rail, off the half in 57 and 3. DP's May moves up in sixth on the outside, still four lengths from the front, around Katie Bell, who needs room, then BP Silent Weapon, Illini Jude, and OG's Susie P. Major Countess is the leader by three parts of a length. Apple Dumpling is there. Here comes Zibber Bibber B, three wide, and DP's May will come four wide behind her, and Specially Fine is looking for room. This race is still wide open. Three quarters and 128 and three fifths. Zibber Bibber B goes to the lead past Apple Dumpling, but here comes DP's May, then BP Silent Weapon. Katie Bell is way wide from fifth. Final eighth mile, DP's May goes to the front of the field, opens up by two. Katie Bell on the far outside trying to grab second as Zibber Bibber B and Specially Fine are third and fourth at the line. DP's May takes it. DP's May by two. Katie Bell was home second. It is close for third, either Patetico or Specially Fine for third. In that photo for show, it was the two Patetico who got up to be third. And number seven, Specially Fine, was fourth. Into the winner's circle for the eighth race. Here's the 1A, DP's May. Clay Simpson with the winning drive. Buddy Simpson of Fairfield, Clay's father, is the co-owner along with Phil Pierce and Dixie Ackerman of Carmi, who bred this spectacular deal filly from the French chef mayor, Rayleigh Ann Ack. Nine wins and 13 starts now for this filly. One eight exacta, $41.00. 80 cents. Grab a quick word with Buddy Simpson, and he's, I believe, got to get back quickly to the paddock area. But, Buddy, 
we often talk about the fact that you've had a uh, storied involvement in harness racing, and you, if I remember correctly, had a connection to a horse named Ayers who won the Hambletonian and stood right here in this winter circle for John Simpson in 1964. What was your relationship with that great trotter? I was a blacksmith that shot him the day that he went down here. Had to be a very special moment to shoe a Hambletonian winner. Not many people can say that. Folks, this gentleman from Fairfield is a veteran of the Korean War, longtime standard bred trainer. He's had a lot of success in this state. Buddy, you're a Class A gentleman. Congratulations to you and Clay and Phil and Dixie and the whole bunch. Good job. Thank you much. That's Buddy Simpson, folks. Fairfield.